So in the last video, we have seen uh, this uh, single level inheritance. In this, we'll talk about the next one, which is multi-level. Now, what exactly multi-level is, let's say we have uh, a class, one more class, in which I need three features. We'll say add, sub, and mul with, for multiplication. So this class should have three features, addition, subtraction, multiplication. So we can simply say ext it extends. And since I need all the features, so what I can do is I can say add sub mul extends, it is add sub. Now, so we have already using the feature of add sub in which I have two features or two methods public and sub. Here we can define the third one which is public void uh, multi which is for multiplication. And here the result should be result equal to num1 into num2. Yeah. So if you have a class which extends a class which is already a subclass, so this type of inheritance we call it as multi-level inheritance. Simple. So we have this single level inheritance and then we have this multi-level because add sub mul extends add sub and add sub extends add. Now here this add class is called as this is called as parent class. It is also called as super class. And there is also called as base class. Now this add sub here uh, with respect to add will be called as child class. So if you say this is parent, it becomes child. If you say this is super, this becomes sub. And if you say this is base, this will become derived. Okay, so with respect to add, this add sub is a child class or you can say a subclass or you can say a derived class. But what about add sub mul? Add sub mul with respect to add sub will be again a child class or a subclass or a derived class. And add sub with respect to add sub mul will be a parent class. Clear? So we are creating the hierarchy of grandfather, father and child. So this is multi-level. Okay. But let's say, uh, then we have one more thing called as multiple. Now what is multiple is, so let's say we have a class and this class is called as calc. Now in this calc, I need all the features. So we, we want features from add. So what we can do is we can say extends, add, comma, add. Let's say we have another class called as division. But unfor let's create a class called division to just show the demonstration. And just imagine this division class has a method called as div. But still, you can see there's an error. It says you cannot have, uh, you cannot extend to class. Now, why we cannot do that? So we I have another video on that, why we cannot have multiple inheritance in Java. But you can see practically we are getting an error. So in Java, we cannot use multiple inheritance. Or you can say Java doesn't support multiple inheritance directly. Now, you can do it with the help of interface. Again, you can jump to my interface video to see the demonstration. Clear? So, we cannot go for multiple. So, we can use single or we can use multi-level. 